CNN, the Anti-Defamation League and a New York City councilman are calling out Mayor Bill de Blasio after he condemned a large funeral gathering, saying he targeted the entire Jewish community when only one group of people broke the rules. De Blasio said the gathering for a rabbi's funeral Tuesday in Williamsburg, New York, was absolutely unacceptable and noted it won't be tolerated. Something absolutely unacceptable happened in Williamsburg tonight, a large funeral gathering in the middle of this pandemic, de Blasio tweeted. When I heard, I went there myself to ensure the crowd was dispersed. And what I saw will not be tolerated so long as we are fighting the coronavirus. My message to the Jewish community, and all communities, is this simple, the time for warnings has passed, de Blasio said in another tweet. I have instructed the NYPD to proceed immediately to summons or even arrest those who gather in large groups. This is about stopping this disease and saving lives. Period. ADL CEO Jonathan Greenblatt responded to the mayor, accusing him of generalizing the entire Jewish community when only a small segment broke the rules. Hey at NYC Mayor, there are one mil plus Jewish people in hashtag NYC. The few who don't social distance should be called out, but generalizing against the whole population is outrageous especially when so many are scapegoating Jews. This erodes the very unity our city needs now more than ever, Greenblatt tweeted. New York City Councilman Kalman Yeager echoed similar concerns, saying it was unacceptable of the mayor to condemn an entire community after the Williamsburg funeral incident. Mr. Mayor, your words are unacceptable. To condemn our entire community over one group of people is something you would not do to any other ethnic group, and I know you long enough to know that you know this, Yeager, who is Jewish, tweeted. Religious events and funerals remain a challenge, NYPD has said. CNN has reached out to several Jewish organizations in Williamsburg to get more information about the funeral and for comment on de Blasio's remarks. The New York Police Department had officers near the corner of Bedford Avenue and Rutledge Street, where the crowd gathered, Lt. John Grimple confirmed to CNN. As of 11 p.m., the NYPD had no record of summonses or arrests from this incident. Previously, the NYPD has said that some officers have encountered challenges at religious events and funerals, noting efforts were geared toward maintaining the dignity of those events while insisting on dispersal of groups to ensure social distancing. Close dialogue the day's biggest stories in 10 minutes or less. Sign up and get access to videos and weekly student quizzes. Sign me up no thanks by subscribing you agree to our privacy policy. The mayor also tweeted about difficulties surrounding funerals. We have lost so many these last two months plus I understand the instinct to gather to mourn, the mayor wrote. But large gatherings will only lead to more deaths plus more families in mourning. We will not allow this. I have instructed the NYPD to have one standard for this whole city, zero tolerance.